Oh, our first winner. Oh. So last week uh, I went to my buddy and I gave him that helmet and that uh, Senna headset thingy. And now I'm driving to my other best friend and he needs a headset too. Yo guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. In today's video we are going to unbox Defender for the Super Duro. Now I think I ordered maybe three, four, five, I can't really remember, or some shirts. And as every time I make a video, I start looking at Super Duro and sometimes I think like, what the hell have you been doing? And in this case, last week I had too many stickers and I put a little bit too much stickers on the bike. So uh, I'm gonna take some stickers off. I know, I know, I'm losing a lot of horsepower by taking the stickers off, but it is what it is. And if it's not looking too good to me, I don't want it. So uh, first things first, let's remove some stickers and then uh, let's start unboxing. <gasps> oh no, he's pulling off the Austin Racing stickers. Why, why would you do that Smokey, why? You're getting sponsored by Austin Racing, why did you pull the stickers off, why? Because I still got them over here. Over there, over here, and over there. And I got a giant exhaust on it that freaking says Austin Racing. So I pretty much got a lot of things that say that I've got Austin Racing exhaust on my bike. And too many stickers are just not that as appealing as I thought it would be. And I'm really liking this bike's ass, but um, I thought three YouTube stickers underneath it would look pretty awesome. But, well, it's totally not. So I uh, removed those two. Very nice, very nice, Smokey, very nice. Let's get to unboxing. So these t-shirts are from 24MX, it's like a motocross dirt bike shop and I only order them for working on my bikes because they are 3 bucks each, 3 euros, like 3.99 or 2.99, can't even remember, but like 3 bucks a shirt, that's cheap as hell and they're funny as hell too. Look at that, Tyrannosaurus MX. <laughs> I love those shirts. And some other shirts to work in because, well, uh, they're like 3-4 euros yet again. Cheap as hell. Next! As you guys can tell, this was the old fender. Look at that. It's even longer as my nose. My nose pretty big, but... The fender is even longer. Let's unwrap the other ones and see what we got.
Mm, yeah. Mm. It's short one. That's not bad at all. Might not be the perfect one, but this is by far the best already. Let's try the other two. I'm liking this one a lot. Decent. Mmm, I don't know. This is like, this is like really bulky on the sides. It's not as KTM Super Duke R Smudo. It's so huge. Don't think this is gonna be the one. Nope. Really liking this one, so um, I'm gonna cut this one up, drill some holes in it, and uh, try to make it fit and see how it looks. I'm putting so much work in this. It's really costing me blood, sweat and tears. Really blood. I did boo-boo. Now that's a lot better. Went home for a couple of minutes. Had some uh, winner winner chicken dinner. And I just found out my buddy bought a refrigerator. Re refrig refrig refrigerator. Refrigerator? Is that word? Yeah. He called an ass cast. Ass cast. Refrigerator. And it makes ice cubes. He didn't hook it up yet. And I'm thirsty. Oh yeah, a uh, package arrived at my house. It says package. Ta da! It's just another GoPro for a Super Duro video. I only got one, so got one for filming the front. I didn't have one for filming backside, so uh, I got another one. And another thing I just removed is this bolty thingy. Beep beep. It's from the Constance bike lift. The one you see over there. And this one goes into the frame like that. And when you use the Constance lift, this slides over that. This one goes behind the frame and you just check it up. Now here's the issue on the Super Duro. I have mounted the SW Motec crash protection. Now that one goes over there. And that one should go over there. So you you can't you, you nah no. It it doesn't work anymore. So if you get the SW crash protection do not get a constant bike lift because the two really don't like each other. Doesn't work. I'm gonna put this on the Super Duke GT. I'm gonna take this to the Super Duke GT and mount it over there. I'm not gonna bore you guys with putting just uh, some kind of random bolt nut on the Super Duke GT. So I'm gonna end the video. No, I'm not gonna end the video right here. I'm going to my attic, coming home, putting all your names into the in the Wheel of Fortune, and you guys are gonna see who won the contest. As you guys can tell, I'm at my attic upstairs. It's blistering hot up here because I don't have any air conditioning. But um, I'm going through all the names, the comments from the last video. I'm gonna put them in the spinning wheel again. We're gonna spin and uh, we're gonna get some uh, prizes sent. We're gonna get some KTM merchandise going all over the world. It's gonna be neato. I really hope you guys start liking this because I'm already breaking a sweat out here. I'm not doing this for nothing. So here we go, I got all the names in the wheel and every single comment is liked and hearted. That means I've copy pasted your name and put it in my awesome spinning wheel. So here are all the names, you might recognize yourself, here we go, ding a ding a ding ding. Some names I can't even pronounce, I have no idea what that means but it seems to be a name. So uh, here we go, we're gonna do four spins and let's see who wins. 
Oh, our first winner. Oh, it's gonna be. Oh, it was close. It almost got. It was almost Kev H, but it's Laron. Laron. Okay. So, Laron, we got a winner. Laron, first one. Second one. Let's do another spin. Oh, whoa, it's Yeeha Ho Ho. Well, now that's a name, Yeeha Ho Ho. Okay, third winner. Here we go. Yep, it's gonna be Mr. Visbokal. Well, that seems like a Dutch or Netherlands name. And our last winner of the day. Here we go again. This is fine, this is cool, look at that. Oh, it's close again. Oh, oh. Oh, it's a close one. But it's GG KTM. Nice one. Last and final spin. Let's see who won the Super Duro. Hell no, I'm not giving the Super Duro away. It's not even finished. I might give it away someday, maybe. If I made enough money. Congratulations to our first winner, Lauron. I've uh, been going through the comments again and I, I just seen that he bought a 2017 GT last week. So congratulations, you'll be getting one of the four packages. Second one is Mr. Visbokal. I'm guessing he is from the Netherlands or Belgium because Visbokal, that sounds like uh, something a fish would swim in, but in my own language. So I'm guessing he lives pretty close to me. The third one is GG KTM. Now, checking out, I've been checking out his channel. He's a motor vlogger from India. So that's pretty nice. He's gonna get something cool too. Might even send him the slippers. Don't everyone in India wear slippers? And the last one is Hee Hee Ho Ho. And he made a comment and he said, nice. Sorry guys, if you didn't win, don't stop watching the videos because the more money I make, the more things I will be giving away. And that's how easy it is. But Smokey, if you keep giving all your money away, how are you gonna pay for your bills? Hmm? Now that's a good question. I said it before and I will say it again. I have a couple different other YouTube channels and they make pretty good money. So this channel is pure for the fun, for my love of motorcycles. And maybe I want to grow it something bigger in the future and buy a new Ferrari and go off-roading with that. Put some dirt tires on a new Ferrari and go off-roading. Well, that's somewhat the point I want to get. Or maybe a Lamborghini, don't know. Just buy it, dirt track tires on it, and take it off-road. That would be awesome. That's actually the dream I'm trying to accomplish with this channel. But as for now, it's just flip-flops and KTM mugs, so sorry about that. There will be a Super Duro video very, very soon, but my dog just got a cruciate ligament ruptured, so uh, really gotta take good care of my little boy. Well, my dog's my best friend, so gotta really take good care of him. Again, thank you guys so much for watching, liking the video, subscribing, punching the subscribe guy in the face again. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Right safe, guys. See ya.